Good day, everyone. I'm meteorologist Adam Kolpak. High pressure is going to be building back in after the rain that we got earlier today, which was nice, has moved off to the south. With high pressure building in, we'll have more sunshine and relatively mild temperatures coming up for Tuesday and Wednesday here in the Rogue Valley. Our lows for the coast will be in the 40s and 50s. We may see some areas of fog and low clouds overnight into tomorrow morning. More sunshine, though, developing during the day. Your highs in the 60s and 70s. Brookings, they are making into the 70s, it looks like, and 63 for Crescent City. Cool starts, West Valley's in the 30s and 40s. Again, overnight, there's a possibility for some areas of fog and low clouds into Tuesday morning. More sunshine, though, developing during the day. Your highs generally in the 60s and 70s, 73 for Medford. East of the Cascades, lows will be in the 30s, so another chilly start. And then we'll have some clouds around. More sunshine, though, during the day. For your Tuesday, highs in the 50s and 60s, 64 for Klamath Falls and 62 for Lakeview. Here's that seven-day forecast. Highs will generally be in the 60s and 70s, lows anywhere from the upper 30s through the 40s. Again, we could start out with some low clouds or fog Tuesday morning. More sunshine, though, in general after that. I'm putting in a slight chance for some showers by Monday as the clouds start to increase the second half of the weekend. Klamath Basin, generally highs will be in the 60s. Some chilly starts for you, generally in the 30s, but there is even the possibility some areas around the Klamath Basin could get even down to the upper 20s for a few of those nights. And generally more sunshine mixing in with some clouds. Highs in the 60s and 70s, Mount Shasta City. You have sunshine around mixing in with some clouds at times. Cool starts in the 30s to around 40. And for the coast, highs will generally be in the 60s, but with the Chetco effect around Brookings and Harbor, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we may see even warmer temperatures, and lows will generally be in the 40s and low 50s.